Hello, it's Miss Julie from Miss Julie's Virtual Preschool and Crafts, and I am here today to do a fun craft with you. Okay, so I love the story, The Snowy Day, and I love to read it during the month of January when it snows, and so I thought we could make a craft to go along with the Snowy Day story. Okay, I'll show you what you need, and then you can make it along with me. So, first thing we'll need is a piece of light blue paper, okay? That's going to be our background. And you're going to need some snow. So, what can we use for snow, friends? White paint. So we're going to paint white. And then, we're going to need these little printouts of these snowy day characters. So, um, you can find it on the computer. Or if you're an artist, you can draw it yourself. So you got the characters and you can color them red or if you don't want to color them, you can use a piece of red scrap paper and cut them out. You would take your paper, put it behind the character and cut it out. All right. So first thing I'm going to start with is my painting of my white snow. So I am going to Open up my paint, maybe push my sleeves up, and I'm going to start painting a little white snow scene on my blue paper. Okay. So all of our pictures are going to look different, and that is going to be great. I may make a snow hill on my paper. You may make just flat snow where you're walking along the sidewalk, the street. And you're not going to need a lot of paint. So start with a little bit and then go from there. I'll show you my, yeah, I'm just gonna just paint a little bit of snow on my paper. And if you remember the story, there's many different snow pictures in the story of Snowy Day. He does do snow angels on the ground. He walks along, makes a path. He also climbs up a big snow hill. So oh, your picture can be however you like or whatever part in the story you like. Hey, look at this. I don't even need more paint. I have enough paint on my paintbrush to complete my snow. I'm going to dip in one more time into my paint and then I'll have enough. And you can make snow falling from the sky. And you can make Okay, there's my snow. I'm gonna make some little snowflakes falling from the sky. Ooh, I love it. So pretty. Okay, now we are gonna go see, there's my snow hill I made. Now we're gonna go into cutting or coloring our red Boy, so since I have a picture and I have my safety scissors nearby, I'm going to cut out boy that I'm going to put on my picture. And then the boy's name of the story is Peter. Do you remember that? Yeah, Peter. And he likes the snow and he likes to have adventures in the snow. So I'm just cutting out Peter and I'm going to Put him on my snowy day picture. All right, so here's Peter still. I'm cutting him up with the red behind, behind it. That way I can just cut it together. Okay, so if you don't have scissors, that's a, not a problem. You can just color too, it'll look beautiful. He was wearing a red snowsuit in this story. Now, if you don't like the color red, that's okay. You can use your favorite color. If you have a purple snowsuit or a black one, you can do that color for yours. Peter must have liked the color red because he had a red snowsuit. Okay, it's coming along. Now, you probably won't need any glue, friends. 
to stick your red piece or your character piece down on the paper, you're just gonna need to stick it in a wet spot of paint. So that's why I didn't say you needed blue when we started. Okay, it's coming along. See, can you see his outline of his body? Yeah. If you haven't heard this story before, you can go get yourself a copy or you can listen to me read the story to you. Okay, so there's Peter, he's all cut out. There he is. Now I'm gonna hold up my white snowy picture trying to get pink on yourself. And I'm going to stick them on the page like that. I'm gonna add a little bit more white paint to the back of my Peter. That way he sticks. You do not need glue. It should stick to your paper if you just use a little bit of white. Okay, here he is, he's on the paper. There he is. I'm going to press him down using my fingers. There he is. There's Peter out in the snow. Okay, friends, I hope you enjoyed this craft. You can check out my other crafts and stories below from Miss Julie's Virtual Preschool Crafts. See you next time.